So I just got home from shopping. While I was out shopping today, there was this woman who had her toddler in the shopping cart and the kid was pulling an all out temper tantrum. Over what? Nobody knows. Nobody freaking knows why toddlers pull temper tantrums. They just do. He probably had a wrinkle in his sock or something. That's why toddlers pull temper tantrums. Nobody really knows. But this poor woman was trying to calm him down. She was doing everything she could. She was talking real nice to him. She was giving him little things to play with. And this kid would just not stop. It was like the spawn of Satan was coming out of his mouth. He was like, bleh, 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 and he wouldn't stop. So then this poor thing, she starts to, I guess, get embarrassed maybe and feel a little defeated. So she's looking around and to see what everybody's reaction is. And unfortunately for her, she makes eye contact with the tightest butt you know what in the whole place. And this one, instead of giving her a glance of sympathy or some support or, hey, it's okay, she looks at her and goes, as though this was putting a dent in her day. Like, like, like this kid's disruption in the store was putting such a dent in her day. You're not the one that's freaking got to go home with this kid. That poor woman has been dragged through the mill already and she's got to take that kid home. And you're giving her a look of disgust? What else did you want her to do? All I'm saying, ladies, is I keep hearing all this stuff lately. You know, we're supposed to be empowering each other and we're doing marches and we're fighting for rights and we're getting all the things that we deserve and that we want and that we need and we're supposedly supporting each other. Uh, it's on TV all the time. It's in tampon commercials for crying out loud. You would think there was so much solidarity between women. And here we are. We can't even be nice to each other. So all I'm saying is maybe next time you see a woman going through something, because you know you can always, always see it all over our faces, give her a look of sympathy. Give her a look of, it's okay. I feel you. I've been there. Because you know deep down inside you're really just thanking God that it wasn't your kid this time. Because you know darn well it will be your kid next time. So be nicer to each other. I mean, can you imagine what we could do if we would all just bond together and be nicer to each other? We could be like a gang. Like a gang of mothers. A gang of mothers. We could take over the world as long as it was before like 9 p.m. and not on a school night. But you get the drift. Let's just be nicer to each other.